Marzo 16 sa kasalukuyang taon ay binigyang basbas at gabay ni Police Colonel Reynante Royo Reyes ang 47 Levitalized Police sa Barangay Cadre Personnel sa ginawang send-off ceremony ng 2nd Batch RPSB Cadres na ginanap sa kampo ng Provincial Headquarters, Bukidnon Police Provincial Office. Nadinaluhan ni Major Brandy Tangop ng 403rd Infantry Brigade, Attorney Mara Janina C. Onabia, Provincial Legal Officer, Mary Dale C. Dailo, DILG Local Government Operations Officer, at mga piling barangay ng opisyal na may barangay development plan projects at target na gagawing deployment ng RPSB. As your provincial director, I wrote over you, wishing all of you to when you will be deployed uh, starting today. Please do your best shot of doing best everything you do. Always have the intent and protect yourselves from uh, any atrocity. First and foremost, I would like to thank you all for taking time to be part of this very significant event. Over the years, you, our PNP officers, has always been so proactive in crafting new programs that would benefit our people. You have been continuously doing all efforts to maintain our society's peace and order. What we have today is one of your notable achievements and I commend you for this. Indeed, the Revitalized Police of Barangay or RPSB program is such a very good initiative to establish good governance and hasten government efforts in removing communist terrorist groups influence in every barangay. Ginanap din sa Bukidnon Provincial Headquarters Basketball Court ang Friday Breakfast with the Lord, Family of Bukidnon Policemen, Living with Christ. Ang programa ay inumpisahan ng sabayang almusal, pag-awit ng iba't ibang worship songs, kasabay nito ang kamayan at kumistahan ng bawat isa. Nagsilbing couple sharer ang Chief of Police ng Sumilaw Municipal Police Station na si Police Major Larry T. Insiso kasama ang kanyang asawa na si Mrs. Jocelyn Insiso. Ang couple sharer ay nagbahagi ng kanilang mga karanasan bilang buhay mag-asawa. Nagbigay din sila ng ilang payo para sa masayang pagsasama. Anila, hindi madali ang buhay mag-asawa. Marami ang mga pagdadaan ng pagsubok, ngunit lahat naman ay kayang pagdaanan. Basta't may tiwala, pagmamahal, respeto sa isa't isa, at higit sa lahat, ang pagiging matatag sa pananampalataya sa poong matapal. Ang matatag na relasyon ng mag-asawa ay nakadepende sa Diyos na siyang pundasyon ng pagsasama. Nagbahagi din ng mensahe ang ating butihing provincial director. I uh, understand that this is the fourth uh, breakfast that we have together. Uh, thank you to all of the officers that have attended on today's uh, activity, breakfast with our Lord. How we wish that we can we be able to sustain and continue this uh, activity. This is just a one-hour activity with a couple share to share their uh, love story and uh, how they strengthen their marriage. Uh, the purpose of this activity is for a marriage, no? Because nakita na ko na uh, asa mag-start ang ato maningkamot while doing our our work as member of the Philippine National Police is not start because of our commitment and desire na mahatag na ito ang ato kaningkamot sa ato pamilya. So all of us here are majority of us here are married couple. Narito na ang mga matagumpay na accomplishments ngayong linggo. Sa mas pinaiting na kapaniya laban sa most wanted person, ito ang aristado kabilang na dito ang Top 2 Most Wanted Person Provincial Level ng Lantapan Municipal Police Station para sa kasong murder. Top 1 Most Wanted Person Municipal Level ng Kabanglasan Municipal Police Station sa kasong robbery. Top 2 Most Wanted Person Municipal Level ng Damulog Municipal Police Station para sa kasong rape. Top 3 Most Wanted Person Municipal Level ng Talakang Municipal Police Station para sa kasong murder. Top 4 Most Wanted Person Municipal Level ng Valencia City Police Station para sa kasong Republic Act 9165. Top 8 Most Wanted Person Municipal Level ng Manolo Fortis Municipal Police Station para sa kasong robbery. Sa kampanya laban sa illegal na droga, siya mga aristado na may tinatayang 21.35 na gramo ang nakapiskang hinihinalang shabu na may katumbas sa halagang 142,336 pesos. Kabilang na dito ang top 10 regional priority target high value individual ng Malaybalay City Police Station, residente ng Purok 8, Sumpong, Malaybalay City, Bukidnon. 
Labing pito naman ang kabuoang bilang ng naarestong other wanted persons. Lahat ng nahuling sospek ay kasalukuyang nakadetina sa mga police stations at haharap sa kasong naaayon sa nagawang krimen. Pinuri naman ni Police Colonel Reyes, Provincial Director, ang PNP Bukidnon sa mga matagumpay na accomplishments. Dagdag pa niya na makakaasa ang komunidad na patuloy na gagampanan ng polisya ang tungkuling mapanatili ang seguridad at kapayapaan sa lalawigan ng Bukidnon. Mula dito sa Provincial Director's Office, Ito ang Bukidnon PNP News Online.